the Biden administration violated a law known as the Taylor Force Act that prevents funding any group in the Palestinian Authority that would subsidize terrorism. A conservative legal group is proposing the Department of Justice should force anti-Israel activists to register as foreign agents. America First Legal points out demonstrators boosted Hamas after its October 7th attack last year. The group of former Trump officials sent a petition to the DOJ's National Security Division requesting pro-Palestinian groups and their leaders register as foreign agents. War crimes, crimes against humanity, massacres, rape, but still, Gaza stands tall. American Muslims for Palestine denies its link to terrorism. It's one of many anti-Israel groups planning to protest outside the Democratic National Convention. America First Legal argues the group's leader was featured on the website of Hamas's self-declared military wing. America First Legal also renewed a demand for the DOJ's Inspector General Office to investigate whether the DOJ's lack of prosecution of pro-Hamas groups is due to bias. Conservative groups said it obtained non-public information earlier this year, suggesting the DOJ issued an effective stand-down order to U.S. attorneys and to federal law enforcement concerning Hamas's network of U.S.-based supporters. The Biden-Harris administration's director of national intelligence said in July Iran is linked to pro-Palestinian protests. 